Oh yeah, you die. Dude, you know how tempted I've been to shoot myself? <laughs> what? Terms and services just get banned on every single platform. Yeah, yeah, basically. And dude, like, it's funny because Twitch is like where all the porn is. It's where all the OnlyFans models hang out. Twitch? Yeah, dude. I've never been on Twitch. On Dude, Twitch is full. Because Twitch is meta right now. It's like hot tub streams and stuff. So if you go into the just chatting Still? session. Yeah. You'll just like see women with ago. like big boobs and stuff. And, they're and, and then you check their boobs, links and it's and just then... OnlyFans. And it's like, they're not even doing anything other than sitting there and doing like squats for subs and stuff. They're just milking money off of like teenagers that have horny problems dude, dude and like wasn't hot tub streams like two years ago yeah it's, it's still, still going, going. Oh they didn't do anything gosh. you wanna know what they did this was their solution they made another tab specifically for hot tub streams they just saw that revenue they're like oh they're like, how do more we fix people this? are coming to our platform so it's so like instead of it well infesting just chatting we'll this. let it go elsewhere and it's like oh shit I'm dead never mind one HP in a dream I'm gonna yeah, die. Yeah. But yeah, dude, Twitch is Twitch is like so catered for like in terms of like who they decide to ban, they'll ban they they they'll ban chicks that have there was a girl that had sex on stream. I heard about that. Seven day ban. And dude like and then there was another guy that like just dropped his fish by accident and got like a month long ban. His fish? Yeah, he had like a pet oh, fish for and, animal brought, cruelty. Yeah, and he got banned animal for cruelty. one month. And I'm like, oh yeah, but then Alinity can huck her cat behind her head and throw her cat. Oh, that shit was so funny, dude. And I'm like, dude, what the fuck? Like, Twitch is so barely, bad with her. They're biased. She didn't even really hug her cat. Her cat I was mean, fine. honestly, I don't think she should have gotten banned for that period. No. I don't think people should have been outraged, but it was the inconsistency with Twitch's rules that pissed people yeah. off more. I remember when that happened. Oh. Alinity was fucking yeah. crazy, dude. She's actually been on a bit of a redemption arc from what I remember. She's Has like, she? yeah, she's like chilled out. I remember her being like bad. Blessed are the happened, meek, dude. for they make easy targets. Damn, that's edgy shit. Blessed are the meek, for they make easy targets. Yeah. Because oh. <laughs> all they can do is just run away. They don't have anything to defend themselves. This is just an America simulator. Oh, of course a bunch of <laughs> cops come out of the, the donut, donut shop. shop. <laughs> Bro, why is that cop in the window? <laughs> He's just staring at you. So how this game is, I think, is they they physically like draw like a 2D landscape and then they put collisioning over it and a 3D models over it. So then stuff like this happens. I can oh, believe shit. it. It looks good. Like, no, yeah, this is this is the Redux as well, so it looks better for because this again this game came out a long ass time ago. Yeah. Oh shit. I thought it was gonna be first person. Like, even the animations look really good. It looks smooth. Yeah. How are you shooting me through a wall? So, Whoa. Jack, uh, <laughs> we I know you mentioned this before, but we barely saw the street, like, the stop sign just gone. Oh, it's yeah. just like a wooden post right there. <sighs> I just noticed that, like, recently. That that stop sign is a guy. Because we gone. just took it. We took it that Yeah, I know. Night. You guys took it. I remember you saying that, and I'm like, no way it's gone. <laughs> and then I, yeah, I get and back Then we and come like, back oh, shit, and we see gone. that it's gone. Holy. Yeah. There's another wooden post down there. Like, yeah. if you keep going do down the street. When you, like, steal stop signs and stuff, like, what do you do with them? Decoration. <laughs> just <laughs> like, you've seen my basement. Yeah, yeah. yeah. His basement is decked just out with, like, all sorts with. of street signs. I got a school speed limit sign. I'm still mad I didn't get the lights off that. Oh, because it was just so too cool. late to get it. I didn't have the right tools, and then it was gone the next morning. Damn. Which was surprising, because it was like behind a church, and kind of hidden, but so invited. Oh, is that the one I helped you? Get, no, or is that a different one? I was with some chick that with that one. I don't remember which one you helped me with. But no, I stole the stop signs because I wanted to make a skid plate for my truck. <laughs> and my buddy wants a skid plate for his focus because he just slammed on the ground. Oh, yikes. He's running like, I think like 11 degrees or some shit in the front. Ten, I think it's 15 in the rear. I don't know. That thing was on the ground though. Yeah, He's like, oh, I need a skid plate. <laughs> oh, holy shit. They get smart with those, dude. No, they do. It's a science stealing street signs. Let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I want to hear this. Well, like, so everyone on a metal post has um, tamper-proof rivets and stuff. Mm -hmm. So those are usually out of an option unless 
what we recently did, me and Caden, before we went to. He's nuts. I think it was after. We went out middle of nowhere, found a cow sign on a metal post, pulled it out of the ground. It was right in front of a house, so we didn't want to like drill and stuff. Mm -hmm. So we took it back over by the Willard, right. and we drilled the rivets out. But like. It's really loud, and you can't really do that every you time. You can't really do it in, like, a residential Sometimes they're concreted in the ground. But, like, those wooden ones, this was the first time I'd ever seen it. They had, so like, tamper-proof nuts really? on the other side of the <laughs> bolts. Like, usually, like, the one right by your house uh -huh. that I took, mm -hmm. um, they're just bolts that go right into the wood. Just like into any so it's other. it's just easy to steal. Yeah, they're just like any other. In fact, I bet the bolts are still out there. I think I left them on the <laughs> My bad. Pick I don't mean to them. litter. But, um, yeah, like, that was the first time I'd ever seen that. Like, it, it's crazy how the lengths they go to s <laughs> keep people from stealing them. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. There is an art. Have you, like, sold one before? Um, uh, no, I have not sold one. You think they'd sell for good money? No. No? Unfortunate. But it's still a lovely collector's item, nonetheless. Oh, yeah. Well, like, it's not about the street sign itself. It's about the story behind it. <laughs> that's, that's the, the biggest thing. Like, like, if you want thing. to buy a street sign off someone that's stolen, what are you doing? Like, that's stupid. Mm -hmm. Just buy a regular street sign that's not, like... Has nothing government behind property because like there's tons of companies that make street signs. I'll pay. Yeah, and they could just do like custom buy. ones and stuff. Yeah, they do custom all that. Like you don't need to buy. You from just someone doing I should get one from my door that says no sex on it. <laughs> Instead of it being a laminated piece of paper, it could be a metal sign. Yeah, it would probably sick. only be like. 30 bucks that's worth oh, that's, that's worth i follow a dude on tiktok who does it actually. who does it yeah <laughs> he's like a metal plate and yeah. then has this all machinery what a great little side hustle a honestly, business, honestly a lot of people that would actually into. pay for like street signs like that oh yeah so yeah that's obviously like you know but custom street signs i mean at least yeah is that a military and all, a he military does, guy. all he has is that roller press yeah laminate. literally that's all you do there's oh. now a rock. Well, I got a rocket launcher, and there's military. Not saying it's easy to up. do, but like it's something you can learn to do. <laughs> you know, do you ever walk around school, see the pretty boys, and be like, "Man, he looks kind of dumb." <laughs> or like, have you ever hung out with them and they they act kind of dumb? Yeah. Like, what do you mean by pretty boys? Like, like just good looking feminine. dudes. Okay, good looking just guys. Good looking like, guys. I know a dude at my school that kind of looks feminine looking no. a little bit, and I feel bad for him. No, I'm, like, I'm just talking about like dudes who. They either got good genetics or like they, they rely take on their care looks. of themselves. They really have they have good style, you know, mm -hmm. just stuff like that. And at least the ones that I've hung out with, mm -hmm. they all kind of seem a little brain dead. <laughs> Not, I don't, uh, and it, it, in just over the years, it's become just a stereotype. Uh huh. All of a sudden, it, like I just didn't like really, people who are like really attractive are just like really dumb. Kind of, yeah. Not necessarily with it's, women. I would, I would think it's because like if you're more attractive, naturally you're gonna, things are gonna be easier for you in like a social sense. Maybe. So you you have less reason to be smart. Yeah, and it could be that it could be jealousy. I don't know what exactly the stereotype mm -hmm. is, but TikTok especially is really oh, no. opened yeah, up your mind really... to like, hey, these dudes are actually smart as shit. <laughs> Uh -huh. Like, they're out here doing businesses and, like, oh, yeah, putting yeah. in the work. And then they get caught texting a 14-year-old, and it all goes downhill. <laughs> oh, those are the TikTok stars that just do dancing yeah, and stuff. Right. I'm talking about the ones with legitimate businesses oh, oh, yeah. who are, like, Like, that are not too big, but, like, they have profits. Yeah, like, they're, they are living comfortably at, like, 19, yeah. just graduated, and... And they already have, like, this huge, like, company. Yeah, and, the, like, building a company is not easy. It's not easy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Especially getting started. And learning how to do that is, well, it's easier than ever, is still, there's a lot of, to it. I mean, as, as time goes on, it'll probably get easier, but, like, holy shit. It's just the information it's nice. that gets easier. Yeah. I'm looking for the last guy. Where the fuck is the music? I don't know. It's just so silent. I thought there was music, but I don't think there is. Oh, Exit there is. is open. You've oh, killed 96. I got to get them all. 
No, you don't. You gotta get ninety percent. No survivors. <laughs> Proudly made in the USA. <laughs> it's crazy that this shit came out in nineteen like ninety ish. And he says shit I like, mean, only my gun you understands just kill a me. bunch of civilians in the middle Yeah, no, of the, the civilians are just, like, there. But, like, you have the option to just kill them. I'm going to pause real quick and just make sure we're recording. I got that anxiety moment where I'm like, what if we weren't recording? <laughs> Probably. This has oh. been one of our best recordings. <laughs> you want to get content dense, let's talk about the new um, <laughs> trade currency for oil. Going on trade currency, trade for currency oil. For it's, oil? Like the, Explain. it's like the yuan or something. China, Russia, and the oil. Oh no, I've actually States. heard about this. Yeah, this was like really two hear- days ago. I, yeah, I didn't really hear. Oh shit, <laughs> they're doing it. Like it's happening. Yeah, no, it is happening. For and we sure. can't do anything about it. And it's about to plummet the U.S. economy. Yeah, no, so they're they're coming up with their own currency for trading oil. Oil. Yeah. Without us, no, we're not. Because right now it's based on the U.S. dollar. Right. And it's how we control a lot of shit. Mm-hmm. And I did, I don't know what it was, but like people are like instead of using like their own currency or instead of using U.S. dollars, they're using their own currency. Well, yeah, it's a new world currency yeah. basically, because that's what the U.S. dollar is. It's a world currency. I mean, there's so many countries based off their economy off the U.S. dollar. Yeah. And so, if that shit plummets, dude, our no, economy kinda... plummets, the worth of the U.S. dollar is going. That's gonna going to destroy down. the world, especially, yeah, no, real. especially those upcoming countries that are. Oh, it's gonna be bad. Yeah, no, it's it sounds like it's gonna be bad. Holy shit. This next year is gonna be the definition is we're gonna experience something that nobody no one else in history has experienced. I was talking with my dad and he's like because we're in a recession, right? But like for some reason at least ho- like house prices, for example, aren't, for example, aren't dropping yet. And like well, people are like here, holding yeah. on. Are are they dropping el- elsewhere in the States? Uh I think they're dropping here and there in different areas yeah. it's not gonna drop just mm. because it's such a desirable place to live now right oh yeah it, it's especially for outdoorsy people yeah, yeah. The, like, the mountain the mountains are really nice like skiing spots the climate around here is just it's it, the weather just com- basically it's kinda... yeah people complain about it that live here but for outsiders it's pretty it's like nice pretty... it's like oh, it's something different i it's, guess yeah it's something different it's great for uh, Nature people, outdoorsy types, because you but get a, right bit, now, a little bit with of everything. The flooding and everything. Oh, that's flooding about the uh, up river. Have you seen how it is? My buddy tried to get me to float it. No, I'm like dog, I'm just like two feet of clearance <laughs> under bridges. Yeah. I'm not gonna float that. <laughs> no, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> we saw a sheriff coming out of the Net. canyon looking for someone that fell in. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, some people ki- falling. I don't they're remember. Like, they're being stupid and just going in. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't get two feet <laughs> within like two feet go, of like that I, river. <laughs> that I've seen f- how it is, and it's like it's up to here. Oh, it's, like, holy it's shit! It's full and scary. And it's going fast. Oh. Yeah, and there's a lot of rocks under there. Oh no! So yeah, so if you get under there, you're kind of Bob up. Yeah, you wouldn't survive very long in that river, especially how cold it is. You go into shock, get thrown under the water, hit your yeah, head. Yeah, so you just die from whatever. <laughs> It's like <laughs> just a little parade, you know, <laughs> just shoot everyone that's down. Uh, I should have gone with the molly and just lit them all on fire. That type of massacre would go in the history books, dude. Oh, for yeah, real? It would be like a Boston massacre type yeah, of... Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Many in- innocents die. So who are oh, you yeah. playing as? Like this postman? Or is it postman? Or is it I just don't like... know. Some he's, he's referred dude. to as the postal dude. That's his canonical name. The he doesn't have like a real name that we know of. I mean, he has, like, these corny lines, so holy shit. Yeah, bro, it was like a Marvel character. <laughs> wow, shoot that Oops. tree. <laughs> I meant they pull up my revolver, because this thing's nutty. All that shit did was give you a scratch, it was like, <laughs> yeah, 3 <no>. HP. <laughs> it, like, it's like, if you shoot yourself, oh, you're fine, but if somebody else shoots you, it's like, takes up no, your yeah, whole No, yeah, you die. Health. Dude, you know how tempted I've been to shoot myself? What? <laughs> With not, what? Not like in the head or anything, like suicide. But I'm like, just shoot, about like shoot, shoot like a gun in like your leg or something yeah. to see how it feels. I was I was out shooting my 22 a little bit ago. I I was so tempted to just put it up to my <laughs> arm or something and shoot myself. Just feel. Oh. 
It's, I'm so curious. Intrusive like, thoughts to the max, dude. No, honestly. But, like, it's, it's so like, interesting. I wonder how it'll feel. That's what I'm saying. Like, it, I, it won't feel good. Right. Don't well, get me wrong. It hurt. I'd probably be crying. But The amount of, a, like, adrenaline, like, just going through. Yeah. The thing about I'd like suppress it a little bit, but yeah, you the know, thing about adrenaline that though is that like happens during like situations. Situations of, like, are like you know. So like like that's why like during like war and stuff, like adrenaline will kick in and you won't feel it. But in a situation where you're just like, hmm, I wonder what this feels like, and then you your heart be like, racing, yeah, you'll just be like, boom, 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 boom. but like. I don't know. It's just like guns have such a big thing in our culture, and mm-hmm. every like right now we're watching a bunch of people get shot. Like, what the <laughs> fuck does that feel like? Like most <laughs> games require know. you to have a gun to be able to defend yourself. So, what? Most games? Oh, games. I thought you said states for a second. <laughs> you need like, to have a gun. I mean, you have the right to bear arms, so like you can have a gun. Yeah, but require. <laughs> no, you it's don't. You different. don't. You're not Shoot, necessarily just force required. People have guns from now. They just double down. Shoot the flammable tanks. Like this? Burn down the whole yeah. building. Probably made in the US. <laughs> they just said probably. Probably, yeah, he's like, probably made in the USA, baby. You just 360 them? Yeah, yeah, we 360 no scoping out here. Remember that shit? Call yeah. of Duty 360 no scoping? That stuff was can so like... Can you go like, inside buildings? Um, some of them you kind of can, but not really. Only this would a be a bit. beautiful place to live. In the forest. This looks like a spot where you like spot those Appalachian Appalachian monsters and stuff. <laughs> Skin like walkers? cryptids. Cryptids, that's the word. Windigos. This looks like a place where you'd find them. Honestly, it's like you're taking a stroll out in the forest. Taking yeah, a look stroll, at that you back door something. right there. You walk out of that back door to smoke a cigarette and you just <laughs> see like a skinwalker staring back at you. <laughs> Or something like something in the forest, just like you know, that's yeah. you know, it's not an animal, it's like something. Oh, that lady's just stuck there. These spots are weird. There's these spots in almost every map. There's just like a yeah, there's collectibles, but they also got like a rocket launcher. What oh. the? Is that a tank? What? No, I'm gonna get comboed. <laughs> I'm actually gonna get comboed. Exit. I can't get up. The- no, oh, you I actually fucking left, died. Bro. I was about to say, the exit was open. Yeah, the exit has been open. That <laughs> going intent. for that 100% massacre. Why? They're going been... that genocidal route. And, like, these screens right here showing, like, everybody dead on the street. Yeah, this game's a lot darker than, like, OG Postal. Oh, wait, I have landmines? And dynamite? Hey, guys. Oh, land shit, mines. I lit myself lit yourself up. on fire. I can't imagine landmines would be very Instrument effective disorder. in this game. Jack, I cannot hear you... Just due to this, all like screaming. Dude, I'm so close to the mic. I'm it's trying. Just, it's, <laughs> it's just like the game. It's the so game loud. Is, yeah, here I'll turn it down more. No, but I can't imagine landmines would be very effective in this situation. Yeah, you'd have somebody. <laughs> you'd have to throw it in and have somebody in the middle step on it. It'd be a real cart Looney Tunes moment to step on a landmine while just see everyone go shoot out. up the town. <laughs> yeah. I should do that. Like during the parade, I should set the landmine in front of them, see if they'll like move. <laughs> Yeah, but you're gonna have to die. <laughs> they step on it and they do oh, that little like bastard. gulp okay, thing. They're like, you fire, then. and then just blow up. Meta. We out here gaming. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what just the hell scream. is going on? Damn. This game is dark. What the fuck? Yeah, I wonder. I wonder, like, uh, cause like. We're at, we're at a time, like, where, for example, like, Patrick Bateman from uh, the the American Psycho, he's, like, idolized. And he's, like, looked upon as, like, a cool guy. And it's like, no, he's not that good of a dude. Your siblings are going at it downstairs. <laughs> Wait, are they fighting? I can hear, like, screaming. I don't know if it's them, like, them, like, playing their game or whatever. I would assume it's that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume it's that for my own sake. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The sun, the sun goes down down there. Feels good. Too late for that, buddy. Jeez. Got a landmine. We got time bomb. Whatever the hell that disc is. What's this thing? 